Hi, uh, hello, everyone. Welcome back for more of Pokemon Crystal. I'm not exactly sure what I've planned for today yet, but my intention with today was to beat Morty. Did I talk to people there? It was around three. Oh yeah. Now yeah, my plan was to do Morty and maybe not Morty, Faulkner, and maybe a few other people. But time got away from me. I woke up with a massive headache. That did not help. Ghost a rumor to appear in the Sprout Tower. They said normal type Pokemon moves, but had no effect. I have foresight, which apparently works. So I, for t I'm probably going to try to beat Falcon. I'm probably going to go for nowhere in like 20 minutes if I can. I collect Pokemon. Do you have Bellsprout? No. No. <gasps> Maybe. Steelix is in this game. That's cool. A Pokemon you get in a trade grows quickly. But if you don't write gym badge, they disobey. Steelix evolves with trading with Metal Coat, isn't it? Not happening. <laughs> They can try actually healed. I didn't go to the Pokemon Center and just quit. How long is the Sprout Tower? That could be an idea too. The city of nostalgic sense. Oh, you have no idea. <laughs> oh, this treat. Oh, yeah. Yeah, back in Pokemon Yellow and Blue and Red, they didn't have that option. You had to press start every time to check. Earl's Pokemon Academy. Do they have the thing in this where you just press like A on a tree and it says, Do you want to cut? I'm taking notes on the teacher's lecture. I better copy the stuff in the blackboard too. Yeah, we're not going to learn about Pokemon stuff. I know the basics. We'll talk to these guys. I traded my best Pokemon to the guy beside me. It's kind of stupid. Huh, the Pokemon I just got is holding something. A Pokemon holding a berry will heal itself in battle. Many other items can be held by Pokemon. It sure is tough taking notes. <laughs> Try to get a stop out ready so I don't go overboard too, so I don't go like even 10 minutes over because I've worked tomorrow. <laughs> I've worked in about 12, yeah, 12 hours. Don't make any errors. Faulkner from the Violet Pokemon Gym is a fine trainer. He inherited his father's gym and has done a great job with it. Uh, oh god. Ooh, Berry. Who knows? That could save me. It probably won't save me. In. Uh, do paralyzing stuff heal you as well or just status effects? Oh. You can just leave. <laughs> I was gonna check the map. Down yeah, that just leads me to what's what's next? I'd say this is the generation I remember the names of the towns the least. Azalea Town would have never gotten that. Right, uh, let's not. <laughs> Since this is kind of on the way to more stuff. Do you know what we'll do? We'll at least do the, uh, what's called? The preview trainers. <laughs> hey, I'm no trainer, but I can give you some advice. Believe me, if you believe a championship dream, you can come true. What? That was weird. You believe? Then listen. The grass type is weak against the flying type, is it? I didn't know that. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Keep this in mind. Violet City Pokemon Gym. Okay, how many are here? Probably just one, two. Good. Let me see if you are good enough to face Faulkner. I mean, if there's two, why not? It might help me level up a bit. <laughs> Bird Keeper Abe. Sparrow. I see the first. I like Sparrow. I really like Pharaoh as well. Level 9. The hypnosis could be a lifesaver in this. <laughs> sure. So I can't imagine Bobble doing more than like 2 damage. And one level difference. It might be okay. They'll probably go like to, to the start of the P. Just about uh, a fifth of the damage, maybe. Eh. Uh... I don't know. Like, I, I know I can beat at least this battle. Obviously, he has two Pokemon. I have five. Do I have five or four? Ooh, I didn't know speed fell with Bobble. Should I see? I could switch, but... I don't know. I'm so close. I should have switched. I should have switched to Totodile. We get a croc and all before the battle ends. Go on. 
Oh, come on. He's going to be left with one hit left. That's the worst part. If I was one level higher, he'd be dead. I mean, if he's... Uh, that is the luckiest. I even, how rare is it to get five turns of sleep? That was lucky. Okay, I'm happy with that. Easy level up. Oh, he only has one. Okay. <laughs> this can't be true. 216. This is pathetic. Losing to some rookie trainer. This time I'll switch out after I use hypnosis. The keyword is guts. <laughs> Those here are training night and day to become bird boat my masters. Come on. What was it? Sparrow, Pharaoh, oh, Pidgey, Line, Hoot Hoot, Murkrow. W what else could they possibly have here? Maybe they'll do all kind of things, but this early on. Doubt it. <sighs> Weak. At least I'm stronger, and he's lower level than the Sparrow, so. I could probably get like three attacks. But since Polywag is probably not going to be the end all be all here. We'll level up Total Isle once. I think at level 12 he could be a huge help. Don't wake up. Don't be a dick. <laughs> and he hasn't gotten an attack yet, has he? Oh, he got Rage, which I suppose is actually good, but it can be good. No, no. How? No way. It's not. It's so consistent. I have just enough attack to, to get it to like that much left after two attacks. It's crazy. <laughs> Thanks. That's at least twice now that's happened. In three episodes. Twice I've gotten to a point of uh, two hits in a row. Nothing. Third hit when he has this much health. Critical. <laughs> mm. I'll probably go out and heal up anyway, so... Total that's enough. Pff. Come on, come on. Gas look weird in this game. <laughs> Do flying attacks hit ghosts? Stop. What's it every time I do a status fight attack, it misses on the first turn? Not even misses, it just doesn't affect. Like, that's weird. It's just not affecting him. It's not, it doesn't seem like it's missing, it's just not doing anything. Alright, let's try hypnosis. Why, why? Why did I switch to my ghastly? I'm not going to keep raising him, I, I can't trade. Why would I do that? Spinner, I could die in one hit. Who's who? We'll give a shot. Does any opponent here who has a chance to survive? It's not Spinarak. As much as I'd love to. I, that was what I was hoping for. Are we the same level? Yeah. So I get 6 damage. Come on. Come on. <laughs> I never let my ghastly for no reason. I think he's it. Fine. Fine. Don't have a choice. I mean, it's already been six minutes. <laughs> at least. Since I started the stopwatch. We'll just go pure Faulkner. See, that's more like... That's what I want to see. Oh no. I'm going slow. What What? What will I do? <laughs> it's taking up more time. How awful. Yeah, fuck off Pidgey with your sand attack. Somebody level up. I don't care who. Oh. Wow. Gah. <laughs> Faulkner, skills are for real. Don't get cocky just because you beat me. Yeah, before we do anything. We're going back and heal. Just in the off chance, we're going to level up Spinarak once. Maybe one more other. And we'll check over here quickly. Hello, you are trainer? Battle gym leader. Win you did. I was just about to say, I'm not crazy. The translation here is weird, right? But that seems intentional. 
Ooh la la, very indeed nice. That has to be intentional, right? Is that so? Then study shall you. Follow me. Ugh. Yo, does bring me to the fucking training school I already left. You know what we're going to do? Before we heal up. Before we can set a healing twice. Set the mart. Do they just make old people naked? Not even, it's not even naked. It's like they're wearing skin coloured clothes and stuff. When you first catch a Pokemon, it may be weak. But it will even uh, eventually grow to be strong. It's important to treat Pokemon with love. Will do. Pokemon can hold items like Potion and Antidote. But they don't appear to know how to use man-made items. Just berries. <laughs> okay, let's not do that again. I suppose while we're here, we'll buy one. We're sitting at a point where we can check how many portions of stuff we have before buying. Which is a shame. Ooh, flower mail. Oh, is that just like if you send your friend a trade and leave a little note? <laughs> the note says... Penis. I saw a weekly tree up ahead. <laughs> Speaking of which, if you touch it, it squirms and dances. Cool. I swear that wasn't intentional. She used the names of her favourite things to eat. For the nicknames she gave her Pokemon, I mean. I assumed. I call my Pidgey Strawberry. I honestly thought it was a far-fetched. I, I know that's a lot to assume based on that, but... I, I forgot they do that back then. Yeah, this is where the Sprout Tower would be. Route 36. An odd tree is blocking the way to Goldenrod City. It's preventing me from shopping. Something should be done about it. Push it down. I'm guessing I can't go this way. Oh. Did you see that strange tree in the road? That may explain why fewer people are visiting the ruins of Alf. Okay, so we can just... It's nice to explore a little bit, I guess. Why, hey. <laughs> I was going to snap that tree with my straight arm punch. But I couldn't. I'm a failure. Let's see it wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. I have one or two battles here. Maybe catch something. What do I have? Totodile, Poliwag, Spinarak, Ghastly, Hoot Hoot. I could trade that for an Onyx. That could be good against Faulkner. Nah. Don't kill me. Okay, so well, if I poison it... I just want to win one battle with Spinrex so I don't have to switch out and I can level it up a bit better. Just a teensy bit. Just so I haven't to switch it out every time. Come on. Get it all the experience. I'm guessing it won't poison it. But I will win. Wait for it, wait for it. Not now. It's not going to poison him here. Now it's going to poison him. If it can poison him, it's going to happen now. The least necessary time. Oh no, one more, one more. <laughs> well, I guarantee it. I see it coming a mile away. I'm shocked. I genuinely thought poison him at the stupidest time for me. <laughs> That's decent for a level 4 Pokemon, I guess. Is it going to do anything? Of course not. If I bat another Bellsprout here, we'll catch it. Oh, and level Spinrack wants an either Poliwag or Hoot Hoot. Ah, uh, sure, we'll, we'll catch one. Why not? Shame we can't poison it. Yeah, I don't want to waste balls at this point. I'm not really made of money yet. I'll try Lick because I think there's a chance of a uh, damage. Yeah, I think does Lick damage? Yeah. I'm going to keep going with that till it's paralyzed. I don't know if sleep is much better than paralyzed, but. I'll either do three more of them and then sleep, or if I get paralyzed, I'll just go for it. 
Jesus. Right, let's look. What's what? Level 5. Half health. My status effects are not going well today. It always fails on the first attempt. Like, level 5, half health and asleep. Come on. It has to. It's not going to catch it, is it? It's going to waste one. <sighs> Do not want to waste my time catching a second or battling another one. Cool. If it notices anything that moves, it immediately flings its vine at the object. Right, we'll have one more battle to level up the spinner rack. Since that will end up with catching. Or will we? Maybe we'll catch ourselves a... A hoot hoot. Level 4. Risky. If it does more than 2 damage, we yeah, I have to get out. Critical. But no po- Jeez, the poison effects are low today. I probably won't keep it, but I might switch out for Onyx. Even just for Faulkner, that could be huge. I think Bellsprout already has Vine Whip, so it's already a point. We'll do what Ash does in the anime. It was like, hey, we need this very specific Pokemon for this one specific battle. Let's catch it and then throw it away. It's always so close. Always. Like, l that must be like two. At level four, that must be like two health, if even. Fine. Do you know what? Fine. No, not fine. I can't leave it like that. Not when he's like two health or experience from leveling up. Hey, a spinner rack. Let's catch it. <laughs> we'll have two. Yeah, I know it's gonna. What's who? Twelve. Yeah, it'd be fine. Uh, I if because who who was the second or no? Here's the first one I caught. It feels like it'd be stronger. There. Even it feels weird. It's only three levels higher. One. It's gonna poison me. I don't get the luck. They do. See, I know my Pokemon. Should I use Ghastly? Don't know. Polywag. I I I don't know something weird about the red tail. It always looks like it's bleeding a little bit. Oh, I just have bobble too. Is everything's in my just against my favor. Fine, I'm lucky. I'm five levels higher. Go on, go on, do it. <laughs> Every time. Go on, you know you want to. I'm shocked. Unless Polywag is gonna has gonna have like poison resist. No, no, no. Polywag is fine because I know he level. Oh, I forgot. I know he level up during the battle because I, I often gonna use him with his hypnosis and bubble. With for his hypnosis, <laughs> I don't think his bubble is helping that much. It's who? Nice no, behind. You get like what? Is it f no? It's every four steps. So I'm not sure how the damage is calculated. It's probably like 1% or 2% or something like that. Perfect. I wonder. Sorry if this is very, very boring. <laughs> I need something slow. I, I just didn't want to be getting into anything like 40 minutes for this. Not when I'm this kind of messed up. No, I just woke up. I was like, oh, cool. I'm up early enough. No work today. Then... Sudden is like, I want to go outside. Text my friend. 10 seconds later, boom. Headache. Which sucked. So I don't know. It's just one of the worst things to deal with, I think. Because anything you do is just pounding in your head. It sucks. <laughs> He's like, oh, it's not even like just any other fix. Like, or sickness where you can just be like, yeah, I'll just lie in bed, listen to something, watch something. Because that makes it worse. Or at least I can. Scary face. Oh well. Oh. It's Wade. The bug. He's actually pretty close. 
Good evening. It's me, Wade. Were you awake? Are your Pokemon growing? My Pokemon are growing a bit too. Quickly for me. It's overwhelming. Calpy's growing especially. Quickly, I think this will get tough. Oh yeah, we KO'd a wild polywag. With one hit a while back. Bullshit. It went on so easily it felt like a little sorry for the poor thing. I don't know if that's an invitation to battle. Or if it's just... You know. Updates. Dead. Ah well. Please don't let Hootoo be the only French Pokemon I have. <laughs> that would be the worst. If he was the only one just out of nowhere. The only one I'd let get hurt. No. Oh my god. I didn't go up here yet. Oh that's the Sprout Tower. That's where it is. Experience the way of Pokemon. Hey you're a potent trainer. If you beat the gym leader here. You'll be ready for prime time. Okay. So I'm going to have the quick battle here. Talk to Wade just. To, because then I'll know for sure if that's like an invitation to battle. Or if they have to like explicitly say. Do you want a rematch? And that'll be good like 25 to 30 minutes. And it'll be perfect. Then finish that up. Go to bed. <laughs> Not have a headache tomorrow. Because I fuck it. No, to be fair, I got really lucky. The fact I haven't on my day off. I know it sounds like it would suck. Because, oh, finally get it off. And headache, but no. At least it was a day I could just not do anything. Been stuck in work while doing having a fucking head. Ugh, sounds awful. It hasn't happened yet, thankfully. You'll hear from me as soon as I find anything. I'm like, gotcha. I believe you. No, it's switch. We might actually get a hoot hoot level up before the battle. Or, uh, yeah, the gym. They're weak out here, fuck it. I felt it calling to me. I knew it would be a battle there. Hey, a polywag. Whoa. <laughs> Big open mouth. It's really not that much different, to be fair. Level 4, same as the other place. But I didn't find a polywag there. It's not really relevant. But it's true. If I get a critical here, I mightn't even bother healing up for the Pokemon Center. Come on, come on, come on. Ah. And Bubbles all here. I don't know. On one hand, it's only six damage. But on the other hand, at this point in the game, that's like a quarter of my health nearly. Want something cool. I could still switch for the Onyx, which could just just for the experience of trading. And since at this point I know he's gonna level up, it won't make a difference. I'll trade for the Onyx, why not? Then we'll go to the Pokemon. No, we'll go to Pokemon Center first. Maybe Tortodile will even Oh shit. Maybe even thought I'd level up during the next gym. I'm skeptical I'd even beat it. Like, who the fuck does Faulkner have? Who could he have? Like, I already. <laughs> so the only bird pump I know in this game, I don't think he'll have Murkrow. That feels like a later game one, I think. The fourth gym has it, so. Uh, I really can't see it being a thing. This early on. I don't know. Markrow seems like a mid to late game Pokemon. So just the Pidgey line. Doduo. Farfetch'd. Oh wait. Is there a new bird? He doesn't fucking have Skarmory does he? No. No that's. Jasmine probably has that. Who the fuck is he going to have? It can't. Who could he possibly have that would be. Fun to see. Whoops. Oh yeah. Is that true for in-game trades as well? Or do they just go faster for uh real trades? Sorry, Bellsprout. Okay, connect the link cable. I don't actually have to, do I? Goodbye, number 69. <laughs> it's been fun. Hey, that's my oddish. <laughs> Except that's a Bellsprout. My heart there. I actually thought I'd have to have a link cable for no reason. 
For Jambo's best bro, Kyle sends Onyx. Kyle bids farewell to Onyx. Goodbye, my friend. Oh, it's cool. I like the serpent kind of style. Alright, let's go. Look at him. No, that's a really good point to give you this. <laughs> it's like he's flexing his rocks. That's a really good point to give you here. Considering that's the first place and the first town had you know, Brock in the first game. I like that. Got myself best, bro. Thanks. <laughs> now, Onyx, attack. Let's take my best, bro, back. I'll teach him a lesson. <laughs> Alright, Faulkner. Go kick my ass. I was out of all the gym leaders, I think at least for the first half of this game is the least memorable with them. I'm Faulkner, the Violet City Gym. Pokemon Gym Leader. People say you can clip flying type Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity. That's true. I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of the magnificent bird Pokemon. You got so you, you need some uh you need like a, th a thesaurus or something. You can't see you keep saying bird Pokemon. It, it kind of sounds silly after a while. <laughs> See, he's fine. He's no Brock. He's no... No Roxanne. Who... What's his name in... Pearl and Diamonds at Rourke? He's not them. He's no Rock. Pidgey. Okay. Pidgey versus who? Who? Gen 1 Bird versus Gen 2. I was kind of hoping for something... See, I, I do think that's one of the worst things about Gen 2 so far. Overall, it's, it's going to be great, I'm sure, but... And I get that it's kind of connected to Kanto. It's connected to the previous gen way more than anything later on, but... The first gym leader's first Pokemon should be something new. He better have something good for the second one. Because that's usually where the real one comes out. That's where Rourke, Rourke's uh, cranny dose comes out. Or Roxanne with her nose pass. So I'll reserve my comment until then. And yes, we're going to switch. It's about to use... Pidgeotto. I don't like that. I think the second one has some bug Pokemon. He has at least uh I know he has Scyther, I'm pretty sure, but Alright, let's go Rocky. <gasps> what item did I get? I if you've played Gen 1 and then played this, it, it's you'd expect the first Jimmy to have something new. Even a Hootoot, one Hootoot, and I would have taken some of this <laughs> It's just his head. I like that. So, I didn't know that was in Gen 2. I remember Modkip having that and I really liked it because it damages and has a chance of lowering accuracy. Alright, let's get the fuck back. We dead. To be fair, I don't really care if Ghastly dies. I'm not going to keep it. If it could evolve, I would consider it. Even as a Gen 1, I would consider it. Well, and it's only level 9. You can get a level 9 Polywagon Viridian Forest in red and blue, I think. Every time, every time it's the first turn it doesn't fucking work. Why? Oh, that was critical, that's fine. I mean, it's not fine, but... I think I should be safe here. And go right into Totodile. This is going to be a close one, but if I do fail it, I know I can win in the second attempt. Worst case scenario, one level up would be plenty. No! Less than 10 damage, less than 10, less than 10. Six. So four more, probably. If he gets even one critical, which is kind of likely. I, I know I'll win. Like, I'm not going to lose all my points because one more turn after all these attacks will be plenty. Ooh, should I use Leer? No. <laughs> as long as there's no critical, we're fine. Go on, go on. I don't want to risk losing him. Also, okay, is there anyone else I can get one quick bit of experience for to finish? Oh, it is. Wind is good against Bug, right? It, it would kill him. There's no chance it wouldn't. Take the chance. Level up my Hoot Hoot one more time. So I'm going to keep Hoot Hoot at least till I get another bird. 
Less than 10. Less than 10. Less than 10. But I'm slower, so it doesn't matter. To answer your first question, no. I'm not quite sure what I'm doing here. <laughs> I I'm just being stupid. I don't want to lose anyone if I have if I can help it. It's over. No hope. Okay. Oh, good thing for on Jesus level five onyx defenses like this. If oh, you can't get Steelix in this game, can you? Without fucking trading. He is a cool Pokemon, especially like honestly, it's a lot like Gen Four, where just a load of Pokemon from earlier generations got new evolutions, to make them cooler. I appreciate that. That's one of my favorite things about Gen 4 back in the day. It was like, all oh, these Pokemon that I used to love but didn't evolve, now they do. That's cool. There are sometimes that I love a Pokemon but I won't raise. It's just this, half the fun is watching them evolve throughout the game. It takes away a lot of the fun of raising one if they don't. Darn, my dad's cherished bird. Pokemon. <laughs> Five times now. I'm going to try to remember to leave a counter on the screen just how many times he said that. Alright, take this. For defeating my bird Pokemon. It's the official Pokemon League Zephyr Badge for beating my bird Pokemon. <laughs> Jabal got 900 for winning against the bird Pokemon. Send some to mom. And that's Gym 1. Got my Zephyr Badge. God, what are names of badges in this even? To be fair, I don't remember in future games either. I remember Gen 1 because I've played a million times, but... I think there's a Marsh Badge in one of them. No, this is the first one. <laughs> Zephyr badge raises the attack power of Pokemon. It also enables something to use Flash. Ooh. What did he give me? Should I, I got Flash for the Dark Cave. I do love that hairstyle in this graphics, so though. <laughs> I will give him that. By using a TM, a Pokemon will learn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. TM can be used only once. Mud Slap. Ooh. Tempting. It reduces the enemy's accuracy while it causes damage. In other words, it's both defensive and offensive. There are Pokemon gyms in cities and towns ahead. You should test your skills at these gyms. I'm going to train harder to become the greatest bird master. Cool. Step 1. Do I get my name on the thing? Winning trainers Jambola. It's not like the first time you have your uh, rival one step ahead. Nice battle, keep it up, and you'll be champion no time at all. Oh! That, this is where he does. We have to go back to Golden Bark. New Bark. Gold, golden Rod is one. Because I've seen the name so many times today. Hello, Jambola. We discovered something about the egg. My assistant is at the Pokemon Center in Vila City. Could you talk to him? Oh, no, that's, that's fine. As long as he just gives it to me there, we're fine. Nice. One quick little check at my badge. There we go. And with that... No, please. We're going to wait outside because I, I want to do this next time. I'm going to bed. Thank you for watching me actually be faster. I really thought he'd kick my ass. I will say, no disrespect to the game overall. I am I know later ones will be way better. Bugs even will be better. better. And now we have Whitney coming up. That's going to be fun. I look forward to fighting Chuck. I remember liking Chuck. I think his gym was cool. It didn't even have any cool thing with the gym. That's why I'm looking forward to Gen 3 a lot, actually. The gym's really got more fun, I think, with how do you get to them. Yeah, thank you for watching, and... See you for the next one where I make my way to the Ruins of Alf. Maybe to Bugsy. Sprout Tower. Who knows? It depends if I... <laughs> it depends how things go. Hopefully I won't be dying. See you then.